six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ready or not, here I come. Hmm, where are you? <laughs> Found you, Angelica. Ah, oh, dang it, you're good. Too good. Come on now. Now, if I were Freddy, where would I hide? I don't know. He's really small. He is small. Uh, Clover, did you get fatter? What, what are you talking about? Yeah, like, you seem a little bit big. Your stomach's got a bit bigger. My stomach looks fine to me. No, there's something weird going on. You're right. My belly just jiggled. It never did that before. <laughs> and it just laughed too. Hold up a minute. Freddy, are you in there? There you are, Freddy. Yeah, you found me. That was a good hiding spot. Thank you. Cover your package is here. All right, it's here. Package? Yeah, I had ordered a big, ginormous blanket because I got too big for my smaller blanket, my baby blanket. I'm now two, about to be three in two more days. Actually, three. It's August 4th. Oh, well, happy early birthday. I won't be able to celebrate with you. Yeah, me neither. Yeah, not this year, but probably next year. Anyway, guys, let's go see this ginormous blanket. Yeah! <sighs> Here you go, Clover. I opened up your package for you. You know it's a blanket, first of all. You just told me to open it because you weren't really strong enough. So I just opened it for you. Thanks, Dad! Man, Clover, this blanket is ginormous. Yeah, Clover, this blanket is ginormous. Uh, I don't know. About to me, it looks like an average size. Are you kidding? This is the biggest blanket I've ever seen. Not even I have a blanket this big. The blanket I have at home is about the same size as my dad. Now that, I call a piece of paper, cause ain't no way your blanket be that big. Well, I guess it is for you because you're Lego. Yeah, that makes sense. Mm -hmm. Well, now that you mentioned it, it is pretty ginormous. He's even taller than me. Yeah, and I, it's definitely taller than me. All blankets are. <gasps> Cover, you know it'd be awesome? What? We should make a blanket fort. <gasps> That's such a good idea. Yeah, it really is. And I can make the blanket fort. Just... <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> Uh, it's impossible. Uh, Freddy, are you okay? Yeah, I'm almost there. Uh, come on, blanket fort. Uh, come on. Looks like you could use some help, buddy. Yeah, I definitely do not know how to make a blanket fort. Yeah, maybe I should make the blanket fort. And done. What do you think? Mm, I'll give it a 9 out of 10. Yeah, it's pretty decent. I'll tell you one thing though, it's way better than what Freddy did. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think so too. If you look closely, you can see I added a bunch of tape on this side and on this side. Your family has a lot of tape, Culver. I mean, yeah, it's a big family of mine. I mean, it's not like I really use the tape. I mean, I do do magic, but I don't really use the tape that much for my magic. I mean, it can basically be for something else, like art, because my brother Corduroy loves art. Are we talking about tape, or are we talking about this blanket for? Because I want to get in. I'm already in. Make some room for me. And me, definitely. Look at me. I'm sitting on the top. Wish I can fit up there. But for now, just stay at the bottom. Trying to break it, Culver. <laughs> I won't. Hmm, I feel like this blanket fort is missing something. What could a blanket fort possibly miss? Well, every fort has like a doorway, right? Yeah, so? So, basically we don't have a doorway. Oh yeah, we don't. So I'm thinking that we can like put another blanket, like, like cover this, like the front side of it up, but just leave this part of the space open. This could be the entrance. Ah, I see what you're saying. So we have to get another blanket. Exactly. Hold up. I may go get one. I, I kind of like saw a blanket over there somewhere. And there. The entrance is all done. So you could do that, but you couldn't build the whole fort yourself. Well, I never said I could build the whole fort myself. Oh, so you could only build the entrance? Exactly. See? And come back out. Did you just run around in there? Sure did. Come on, there's more room in there. Wait for me. Culver, you're coming. I don't know. I may be too big for it now. Nonsense, Culver. Okay. Huh, never mind. I can fit in here. I underestimated you, Freddy. Yeah, that's okay, Culver. <sighs> we will live here forever. Mm-hmm. We have to protect it, too. Yeah, in case any burglars try to come in. Yeah, and we gotta beat them up. Hey, Sharquisha girl, chill. What the? the hell is this? What the? Hello? Is anybody in here? Anybody in here? What the? Is that Eli? He's trying to ruin our blanket fort. 
You gotta stop him. Yeah, we do. Come on. Hello? I banged on here three times. Hey, stop messing with my blanket fort. What the? Culver? Freddy? Angelica? Yes, it is us. What gave it away? What are you guys doing getting under all those blankets? Doesn't matter. You in our territory. So this is a warning. <laughs> How's that a warning? Ow. I don't find that a warning. <laughs> uh, Freddy? Don't worry. He'll wake up the next day. Oh, okay then. Come on, let's go back inside this fort. All right. <sighs> back in the blanket fort, and we will live here forever. That's right. Oh, oh, guys, my phone's ringing. It's my dad. Your dad? All right, it must be important. Hello? Hey, Freddy, did you practice your ABCs with your big sister? Oh, no, I forgot. You see, I wanted to go to my friend's house. So, yeah, that's why I did. I skipped my ABCs to go see my friends. Well, I say that you come back home and study your ABCs, mister, or you're going to get a spanking. Okay, Dad, I will. Thank you. Not. Oh, clever. You heard my conversation? Yeah, you don't even know your ABCs? Well, I'm still two. I'll be three in September. It's just quite difficult for me. I can understand that. I'm still learning, too. Uh, why don't you try? I basically know all my ABCs. What? No way. No way you know all your ABCs. It's true, I do. I can only name the letters A, B, C, and D. That's it. You don't know the letter E or F or G or H? No, sorry, Bob. Wow. Oh, uh, has anybody seen my tape somewhere? I'm looking for it. Oh, there it is. Oh, hey, kids. What are you guys doing? Ah, a burglar. Should we get him with the blinky this time? No, nah, we can throw hands this time. All right, time to fight. Wait, huh? Whoa. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, ow, 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 ow. Oh, okay, okay, I give up. Golly, I'm just looking for some tips so I can build my new robot. Wow, he's weak sauce. Definitely. Yeah, you're the weakest one in the family. He's not really a fighter. Ah, oh, that makes sense. All right, let's go back to the blanket fort. Hmm? Who's at the door? Hello? Hey, bro, is my son still at home? Yeah, why? Well, I caught him five hours ago to practice his ABCs with a big sister, but gosh darn, he ain't showed up. So, was he here? I mean, yeah, I just said that. Come on inside. All right, great. So, my son's really here? Yeah, he's been here the whole time. They never left. Well, actually, I think he's still in Culver's room, and I did get a big blanket for Culver, so probably there's still blank I see it. Probably Freddy's in that blanket. Oh, yes. Good thinking, Barack. Let's go. <sighs> this is nice. Very nice. It's a home sweet home. Freddy! Uh-oh, that's my father. Freddy, what the hell you doing? I'm in this blanket fort. I called you for five hours, and here you are in this stupid-ass blanket fort. Hey, it's a really good blanket fort. Well, I gotta admit, it is pretty impressive. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Anyway, yeah, you were supposed to be at home practicing your ABCs. Instead, you're just playing. Do you even know your ABCs? Well, I know the first four. Exactly, the first four. You need to know all 26 of them. So get your little ass up here. Uh-uh, I'm not leaving this home. This is my new home, yeah. And if you're gonna make him leave, you would make us all leave by taking down this blanket fort. All right, that's a bet, that's a bet, that's a deal. Ooh, Barack, them kids got me pissed off. I'm gonna take down that blanket fort. How are you gonna take down the blanket fort? I mean, it looks nice. Well, yeah, but he needs to practice his ABCs. Well, I mean, give him some time, at least. Mufasa's still learning his ABCs, and he's like 20. Well, that's because he's probably retarded or something. Who is Mufasa, anyway? I basically don't really know who that is. He's like a lion, all lion. You've probably seen him before. Uh, I might. But yeah, I'm going to get a water bottle and tear that shit down. <laughs> like he can never take down a blanket for it. How's he going to take it down anyway? Yeah, when he's so small. How can I take it down, huh? Well, by using this water bottle. <laughs> Uh, uh. Dad, what are you doing? Uh, uh, uh. Okay, we're getting out of here. We're getting out of here. This is too much. Yeah, you better leave. Whew, that took a lot. No, the blanket forts. Why must one be so cruel? All right, Freddy, now get your red hat ass, long sleeve ass, tight jeans on ass up in this car and get done with your ABCs with your big sister already. Yes, Dad. Oh, Angelica, can't you, like, rebuild the blanket fort? I can at least try. Well, uh, actually, Angelica, your mom just called. She's on her way to pick you up. Oh, man. Sorry, Culver. Actually, I'll just drop her off. Come along with me. All right. Oh, well, 
Thanks, Frederick, I think. <sighs> Dad, why must the world be so cruel? Cheer up, Clover. Well, sometimes life isn't really fair, always. I mean, it's not always fair for me, so it's probably not fair for you this time. Oh, man. <sighs> well, it was good having you, Blanket Fort. May you rest in peace.